So I have to be honest, I thought that this day will never come where Apple would consider replacing Siri on the iPhone. And yes, Apple is now considering this. So in today's video, I want to talk about how Apple is now considering replacing Siri on the iPhone. And I also want to talk about iOS 18.6. One of the final updates to iOS 18, Apple has confirmed two new features that's set to be coming to the iPhone with this next software update. So let's go ahead and dive right into this video. Now, the first thing I wanna talk about is iOS 18.6. This could be one of the last updates to come to iOS 18. We could see other minor updates alongside iOS 18.6 for iOS 18 devices, but don't expect too many new features and changes. However, Apple has confirmed two new features that are coming to the iPhone with iOS 18.6. Now, the first feature says right here, starting with iOS 18.6 and iPadOS 18.6, users in the EU will be able to install alternative app marketplaces from a developer's website. And as you can see right here, this is going to be the installation process. Again, this is going to be for the EU. Now, the second feature that Apple confirmed to be coming to the iPhone with iOS 18.6, by the way, iPads as well, is EU customers will have the ability to also install apps directly from a developer's website. So yeah, this is the process, and these are going to be the prompts that you see right here when you go to install apps or third-party marketplaces in the EU with iOS 18.6. So yeah, Apple has confirmed those two new features set to be coming to the iPhone with iOS 18.6. The software is currently sitting in beta 2. We can expect a few more betas before the official release. So we're looking at perhaps a beta, release candidate, and then the official release. iOS 18.6 will most likely release toward mid late July here 2025. I'll keep you guys posted. It is also rumored that Apple will bring Apple intelligence to China with this software update as well, although that's still not yet confirmed information. I'll keep you guys posted. So now let's talk about the possibilities of Siri being completely replaced on the iPhone. So listen to this. Apple is considering using AI technology from Anthropics or OpenAI to power Siri, sidelining its own in-house models in a potentially blockbuster move aimed at turning around its AI efforts. Now, I have to be honest, ever since Apple introduced the ability to add ChatGPT as an extension here for Apple intelligence, I barely use Siri for any questions. I only use Siri for things around the house, things like turning on and off lights, opening the garage, tasks like that, like maybe perhaps set a timer. But when I have a question, I use ChatGPT on my iPhone directly with the Siri UI. And it looks like Apple could now potentially replace Siri, the underlining model, with either Anthropics or OpenAI powering Siri with these models instead of the ones that they've been working on. We know that Apple is struggling to get Siri up to par to some of these new advanced AI models. And it looks like they're now really considering just getting rid of the underlining Siri models and replacing them with OpenAI's ChatGPT or something like that. So we'll have to wait and see. This will be welcoming for the iPhone. We all know that Siri can struggle trying to get answers, right? So this could now be the next step for iOS 26. Now keep in mind, iOS 26 won't be available until perhaps September 2025, mid to late September. September. We're not sure if Apple will go forward with this replacing Siri models with other third-party AI capabilities. This will be ideal in my opinion to actually fix the Siri issue right now. I'm sure most of you guys probably use other options to get your questions answered on your iPhone. Siri is just not as good as some of these advanced AI models. And we're not sure if Apple will make the move right before the release of iOS 26. I'll continue to keep you guys posted as more information becomes available but we could see Siri replaced entirely on the iPhone with different models, AI models in the future in order to turn around Apple's AI efforts on the device. And I think this would be a great idea at this point. Siri is really struggling on the iPhone and I think we really need a big push in order to get things going here, hopefully with iOS 26. Either way, guys, let me know what you think about this information in those comments down below. Are you hoping for Apple to replace their own models with Anthropics or perhaps Apps, open AI's chat GBT. I would like to know your thoughts in those comments down below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.